For the pain boards, you must know first-line medication therapies for diabetic neuropathy. FDA-approved drugs include duloxetine and pregabalin. Strong evidence according to the AAN guidelines, SNRIs and duloxetine, gabapentinoids, gabapentin, pregabalin. The tricyclic antidepressants such as amitriptyline or nortriptyline used cautiously. They do have some significant interactions and side effects. Opiates and NSAIDs are not first-line therapy. Opiates are not recommended for chronic painful diabetic neuropathy due to poor long-term efficacy and high risk. Additionally, you may see on the exam topical capsation, 8% patch, topical lidocaine, but there's limited evidence, alpha lipoic acid, which is a supplement that has mixed data. For a refractory diabetic, uh, painful diabetic neuropathy, interventional pain management may be considered, such as spinal cord stimulator, high frequency, 10 kilohertz SCS, has level one evidence, improves pain and quality of life. It's FDA approved for painful diabetic neuropathy. So clinical pearls, rapid fire points. Most common neuropathy in diabetes is distal symmetric polyneuropathy. Small fibers are involved first, it's a burning pain. First line meds, duloxetine, pregabalin, opiates are not recommended. Refractory painful diabetic neuropathy, consider spinal cord stimulator. This is a topic that is core to almost any and every pain management board exam. Make sure you understand it. Make sure you understand neuromodulation's role in painful diabetic neuropathy.